Robots come in all shapes and sizes, but usually they look like humans, or human shapes. Okay, so let's create one of those. Now, the classic uh, robot shape is uh, kind of tall and angular. So start off with a big head, a nice uh, long, <laughs> almost like a coffin shaped head I'm drawing here. Uh, right, okay, like that, okay? And the neck, um, you know, coming like that. We're trying to give it a personality as well, as if it's kind of jutting its head forward and looking round at you. Okay, and the body, uh, again, this uh, machine-like shape, which is uh, uh, like a bit like a vacuum cleaner, <laughs> that shape there, okay. And then the middle section, uh, which would be the waist section of the human, uh, perhaps could be tubular like that. And then the hip area, again, could be like the bottom part of this shape here. Okay, and out of that you would get the legs. And obviously you need some kind of jointing, so you put perhaps uh, great kind of joint shapes in there like that. Um, and the top part of the leg, again, very tubular, coming down like that to the knee shape. Again, a big kind of tubular shape there. Come down to the ankle shape, uh, one there, see, like that, okay, and this one going back, perhaps that way, down to again this kind of jointed shape on the uh, ankle, and great feet so they can be stable, all right, like that, very machine like the whole thing. Now the arms again coming, that would become behind the body there down to this joint shape here. Going back up to a joint shape at the wrist, okay. And then the hand which of course, very like a human hand, but again very obviously jointed at the fingers. Something like that, okay. And uh, like that, and the other hand uh, coming in perhaps jointed uh, there, tubular shape down to the elbow, and then down to the wrist, jointed shape, and this hand perhaps going back the way, something like that, and the hand coming in there. See the basic uh, human shape, but uh, very angular, very tech looking. Okay, so let's put the uh, the details in now. Um, the eyes, uh, a great big circular eye shapes, something like that. Okay, another one coming in there. And then to keep the human feeling about it, you can give it kind of, uh, kind of shapes like that, almost the eyebrows coming down to a kind of, kind of no shape, like that, all right. And then carry on with the top of the head. And then the bottom part will have the uh, mouth shape come in, perhaps separated like that from the, the chin shape. <laughs> okay, now of course we need connections, electrical connections and so on. So give the impression that, you know, we are talking uh, Connections here, uh, you could add a couple of cable like things coming down like that. You know, and we could do that with the rest of the, the body as well. You see that? Now, the neck, again, that could be a kind of curving shape with a cover in it like that, okay? Jointed onto some kind of big shape like that. And the um, body shape coming down, into the chest, waist shape, curving. Something like that. Okay, um, the joints up here, perhaps you might get coming out of the body and then you know having some kind of swivel jointed shape like that so the arm can then move, you know, something like that. Okay, down to the wrist again, another jointed shape here down to the hand, which as I said, you know, use these, get these jointed finger shapes in. Like that, okay. The other arm coming in like this, down to 
her elbow joint there and that coming up like that to this joint shape here okay and then the hand again get those jointed shapes in one two three there and two three there and a smaller one there okay like that now this part central shape here again can give the impression that it can be bent so it's kind of like a like a tube and then this waist shape coming down up to our hip joint here you know imagine that uh, you've got that kind of big mechanical looking hip joint there same with this one here you know the leg come in and then like that to the knee joint come in there okay cutting on down to the ankle where we have another one like that and the foot shape coming in just below it there and this big flat shape there and this one coming down like that to this joint shape here and uh, carrying on finishing off down to the ankle joint like that okay and the big flat foot there excellent now we could add some of these little uh, let your connections now okay and we could do that possibly on the inside of that one there some wires in another one coming in there there's a bit more detail you know it's a bit more interesting perhaps one coming up there like that another one coming in there right. I mean designing robots is really fun you can do all sorts of shapes you know as long as you get that mechanical kind of tech look and slightly human look then your robot will look great okay there we have uh, a robot shape great uh, and it guidelines to rub out here uh, not too many excellent okay, we'll hope to see you again soon and remember hit that subscribe button in the meantime all the best and happy drawing